Oh, hi, Nova here. I'm sorry this video is shite quality, but our battery is giving us fucking grief at the moment on our camera. So I just thought I'd record this on my phone. This week, I thought it'd be really fun to go through my growing shoe collection. I've got several, several pairs of ridiculous shoes, um, and I thought it'd be fun just to go through them all. I get a lot of stuff online. I am very lucky that I'm a size 8, so I can squeeze into kind of like the biggest sizes on the high street. But as I said, most of the stuff is online. So I'm just going to go through each pair now, tell you a little bit about it, and how much it was and where I got it from. Before we get into things, you have to excuse these raggedy tights that I'm wearing. I couldn't be bothered to shave my legs for you guys, and I, apparently I don't own any clean tights, so you have to put up with these laddered, weirdly coloured tights. The first pair is a pair of stiletto sandals from New Look. I absolutely love these shoes. I love the metallic panels on the front. The only thing is they do kind of like bend towards the ankle. I'm just too skinny, I don't feel them out. I was lucky enough to find these on sale, they were only £8 and I absolutely loved them. They remind me of kind of like um, Machino and Nicki Minaj, CL kind of look and they just go with basically anything, they're a really good summer shoe. These beauties in mint green were also a sale purchase from New Look. Um, they're made out of like a faux suede and they've got a nice zip at the back. I really love the colour of these, but because of the unique colour, they don't really go with an awful lot. But they're really super comfy, really stretchy, and really, really soft. So these are really fun to wear. This is my last pair of New Look shoes that I own. These were again on sale. Always like in the sale section for bigger sizes, guys. They are covered in little bronze sequins, and I couldn't tell if they were silver or gold to begin with, but it's, I've decided on bronze. And they are really, really comfy again. Lovely stiletto heel with a platform. The only thing is the way it comes up on the ankle, they kind of cut my legs in half, so I'm not really sure about the proportions of them. I bought these ridiculous shoes off eBay from a seller called Shoe Soul and these are like my ABBA shoes. They looked really really good in the photos but on I'm not so sure. Also they're kind of like really cheap made so they, they feel like cardboard almost and you can kind of see like creases towards the ankle when the material is kind of like creasing. But they're really fun to have. They, they look good on the shelf, I suppose. But I don't really wear them that often. This is one of my favourite pairs of shoes. I bought these on eBay again. Um, I just adore the Perspex heel. I love the laces. The blacks are then good with absolutely anything. And what was really handy about these is that the little jewels that have been stitched on, it came with a bag full of replacements. Because if you wear these as often as I do, they do tend to like pop up every now and then. The heels are really chunky and they're really easy to walk in. The only downside about them is that they are a closed toe, so whilst they fit fairly well, I can't really wear them for longer than a few hours. This was my first pair of shoes I ever bought. They are from Iron Fist and I actually bought them on an eBay auction. I think they were about 12 or 13 pounds. They are still the most comfortable pair of shoes that I have. They're adorable, I love the skulls. They're only about four and a half inches high. The zips are broken, so I have actually glued them shut, but because the fabric is so stretchy and soft, they're very easy to slip on and off like a slipper. This is another pair of shoes that I bought from Shoe Soul, and I actually bought these as part of my Buffy the Vampire Slayer costume for Halloween last year. They look really, really cool, but they just don't fit in any way whatsoever. They're too small in the actual size, but then they're way too wide for me. So all that happens is my feet flop around all inside of them and then hang out the edge of the back. <laughs> Now these look amazing and I absolutely adore how they look, but they are way too small. They just do not fit in any way whatsoever and I cannot bear to part with them because I think they're such a gorgeous colour. 
they again are a faux suede they've got these amazing metal metallic like swatches on the front and on the the, the faux heel at the back I just think they're beautiful but I cannot wear them out so that's about all for today guys I hope you really enjoyed looking at my shoe collection don't forget to subscribe to our channel it is youtube.com forward slash Olympia and you can follow me on Twitter Facebook and Instagram at Gina's Nova give me a comment down below which pair is your favorite which pair did you absolutely hate did you like any of them at all and if you've got an idea of a pair of shoes that you'd really like me to get give me a link down below because I would love to see okay guys speak to you soon Bye.